Well, where have I been today? Um, as you can see, we've got a shelf, been organizing it. We've cleaned off a lot of what was on here, put it here. Yvonne's now got all of her stuff there, so any girly looking stuff is gone. Um, I've ordered myself a set of the Upper Deck 9091 cards. Um, why, you may ask? Well, see, I bought all these boxes a while back and I didn't get a set. And I've always been a big fan of collecting hockey cards. And, and the reason why is, is like stuff like this. Like, that's Bob Essence's rookie card. And I know it's worthless. I know that. I know these cards are worthless. Um, pulling them out of a pack mint condition is fun. So I ordered a set because I knew I was going to keep ordering boxes until I got a set. And I intend to put some of these onto uh, magnets to use on my board. Where's my board? My board's downstairs. We haven't got this all finished yet. I'm getting a uh, actual office chair. Uh, we found one for dirt cheap at a thrift store that I like, and I think it'll work. And then we got to have room for the board, and then we're good. So I've talked for a long time about changing the setup here, and I've finally done it. Um, this, of course, being my second week off of work, and I'm enjoying it somewhat. Today was, it, it's a lot of work. Uh, a lot of stuff to go through. We went through five boxes worth of books and magazines, um, reorganizing things. I'm trying to finish getting the... Uh, Funko Pops off of there. I also have a bunch of hockey cards and hockey stickers in here to go through. It's just a lot of stuff. And while I enjoy doing videos for you guys and I want to do them every day, the, the fact is that if I don't get this stuff organized now while I'm on holidays, it's not going to happen. So it needs to get done. It's on its way to being done. Um, my next step is for the uh, lights that I've got here. Um, I don't have the... The diffuser on it right now, obviously. Um, I intend to get that on there, but um, of course I've had problems with the weight on it and it falling over, so I have it a lot lower than I had it before. And I'm intending to purchase um, some LEDs instead of CFLs. And it has nothing to do with the whole cancer thing. It's the LEDs last longer, they're more durable, and I have a feeling they'll give me a better, more uh, diffused light than what I get with these giant hot light bulbs. That's the other thing too. The LEDs would be zero heat and these ones are not zero heat. So we'll see. We'll see what happens. Um, tomorrow we're going to Seattle. So I'm going to try to do a couple of videos tonight. I will try to get a couple of things up tomorrow before we go to Seattle because that's a long drive. I'll take the computer with me. I'll see if we can get any sound out of this computer while I'm, tra while I'm traveling, which is funny because when I was doing road trip videos a few months ago, people weren't happy. However, I was doing those road trip videos before I had this microphone, and the biggest complaint was sound. But yeah, like, when I look through these old cards and people say, well, they're useless, well, yeah, but there's Mark Howe, who's a Hall of Famer, and if I have two of them, then I can have the front on the board, and I can have the back on the board, two different magnets, booyah, I look like I'm all set up and I got props. I'm thinking ahead. Uh, Mike Gartner, Hall of Famer. Kirk Muller, not a Hall of Famer, but, you know, very popular guy and potential head coach. Kirk McLean, never a Hall of Famer, but with, with Canucks fans, he's, he's awesome. Van Beesbrook, I talked about him as one of my favorite uh, Americans. This card being sold, that he was wearing the, uh, the old-fashioned cage. Uh, and I ordered three boxes of the first set of Pro Set cards because I never had those before. And I found them for dirt cheap. So, again, it's about finding cards dirt cheap. So, yeah, every now and then I get asked, well, you know, what would you want me to send you? Anything hockey. Anything hockey. Like, anything hockey will work because I have hockey books everywhere. Oh, and today, sorry, Sarah Jane, I got to move you. Today I picked up. Oh, i got to move Cthulhu. I hope he's okay with that. I found these at, at a thrift store. Uh, cracked Ice. Look at NHL's Inner Turmoil. And Puck Funnies, which is hockey news. And has Mark Bergevin in it a lot, because he was a practical joker and kind of a funny guy when he's a player. So I intend to go through those. I also picked up an old Beckett magazine from 1994, which 
Uh, though I knew those American flags weren't going to make it. I knew they were going to make it. Uh, because of the the American video I made yesterday, Americans will be glad to know Brian Leach is on the cover of the magazine I picked up. My Becky Lynch goggles are going to have to come down for now. I want the Becky Lynch goggles up in the background. Because even though this is hockey, I'm so glad I got the Becky Lynch goggles. And if you don't know who Becky Lynch is, just look up Becky Lynch. It's not porn, I promise. Well, I don't know if somebody's got fakes out. I guess there could be fakes. I don't really, whatever. Browse at your own risk. It's the internet. So, I mean, I got these goggles, which are kind of fun. I don't know. That was from the wrestling show I went to a couple or a week ago. So I want those displayed in the background of any video. Yeah, I'll put that on my earth in black. Funko Pop. And I get asked about my Funko Pops, and they're everywhere. They're all over. I'm going to have to use my phone to do a video. And my phone, I don't know, it's been water damaged. I don't know if the microphone works properly on it. That's why I haven't been doing videos with my phone either. Ha! <sighs> so, yeah. Today was uh, hair raising. Uh, we traveled almost... Well, we were in a vehicle almost as much and, and browsing around almost as much today as we were yesterday when we went to and from Whistler. So, um, not nearly as fun, but long distance or long term more rewarding than going to Whistler but uh, I've still got a lot of work left to do and this isn't even all my stuff there's still a bunch of my stuff that's sitting on the other shelf across the way so yeah we still got stuff to do but uh, what happens when you're a pack rat so anyways I just wanted to let you guys know what was going on and why no videos have been uploaded so far today. I understand if you're on the East Coast, it's late when I'm posting this, so I apologize for that up front, but it had to get done, and it's not like I could post a video before I did this stuff. I couldn't post a video while I was doing this stuff. Uh, it took us hours to get this all straightened out, and there's still a bunch of stuff left for us to straighten out and figure out. And I'm going to get on these cards as soon as possible, because... Uh, there's a lot of fun stuff in here. Like, there's there's Rod Langway, the guy I talk about a lot. So, I, I mean, I can I can do all kinds of stuff with these. I really can. Because um, it's all about creating props. And, and, and part of it for me is um, when I, I look at other channels that talk a lot of the stuff that I do. And I'm, I'm going to talk about the McDavid contract tonight. I did post on Twitter that I would be talking about that tonight. And I'm going to. Um... I try to make sure that I have my own my own view and my own uh, slant on everything. So uh, I intend to continue that. And I think by working on getting this all straightened up, like all of the hockey news annuals are all right here. So that's important because all the hockey news annuals, those are the books I reference the most. Uh, the yearbooks and the, the record books are here. Uh, there, was a, there was actually a subscriber who lives in Langley who messaged me, who emailed me, I think it was almost a month ago now, and and sent me a picture of, I think he had three of these books, and asked, do you want me to bring them out? What do you want to do? And and I never answered him, because like at the time, I was looking at my books, and I'm like, I'll answer them after I figure this out. Now I'm not sure where it is in my inbox. So if you're watching this, um, email me again. Email me again about it. Because, um, yeah, I, I have room for more books, and guide and record books, again... The nice thing with them is you're getting that snapshot into when that team won a Stanley Cup. You're getting that snapshot. So there's there's Dustin Brown. Happier times with the Stanley Cup over his head. And I intend to get this year's guide and record book. It's one of those ones that I didn't have for almost ten years while I was married or twenty years while I was married because I couldn't justify the cost. I couldn't buy all these hockey magazines and then say, now I need to go and get the guide and record book because I would get every hockey magazine. And usually my ex's answer was, well, you've already got all the magazines. You don't need the book. And I can't argue with their logic in that to her, all of it was the same. Um, Yvonne kind of gets it. So she's okay with that and uh, it's good. Um, so this, this collection will get added to next month when all the magazines start coming out. Uh, but I do have stuff to talk about, and I will be talking about that before I go to bed. I just wanted to post this first, let you guys know what's going on. Where the hell's the hockey guy been? He's been trying to figure this all out. So, and I want this 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 lamp. I'm 
so proud that in the midst of a move and all the crap that's been going on and having cats, that this lamp is still standing. Because I'm very proud of this Doctor Who lamp, even if there's just a hockey channel. And um, it even has the... So it even makes the sound effects. Yep. It doesn't stay loaded. But it, it makes the noise. No, get in there. 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 Stay down that time. All right. Thank you guys very much for watching. Hit like and subscribe if you're browsing your way through. Because if you compare any video I've done now with any video I did a year ago, miles between in terms of quality and in terms of me getting to the bloody point. And I'm going to get to the bloody point pretty damn soon. So stay tuned. If you're on the West Coast, grab yourself a coffee, grab yourself some energy drinks, whatever you need to stay up. If you're on the East Coast, I'm very sorry for the dings you're going to get on your phone. But I'm going to do videos tonight. Thanks for watching. I'll talk to you guys again soon.